So you might be in this really weird situation where for some reason you're getting this not enough memory to run game or a low memory issue or error that's going on in your particular headset. Now, this can happen for a couple of different reasons. The first thing that I'd recommend doing for the most part is making sure that your particular game that you're playing isn't completely taking up as much storage as it can on your device. Sometimes if you're running out of actual system storage on your console, that could end up causing some problems as well. So what you may want to end up doing is first of all, seeing if there's any way to clear out some storage in the background. If you're, you know, if you're almost running out of storage, not only is, you know, can the actual storage of the console be affected, but the games and the applications that you're running can also cause issues too. So just try doing that. Another way to kind of fix this problem too, for the most part, is to just go through and see if there's any way that you can go through and essentially restart this headset. So just hold down the buttons to restart it. That can also end up fixing the problem too. And for a lot of people, that might be all you really have to do here too. If you end up, you know, kind of just, you know, powering it off and powering it back on. Now, if you do that and that's still not working, you may want to see if there's a way you can actually update your headset. A lot of the times, if your particular quest is just not, you know, if it hasn't been updated in a long time, you may just have to go through and update that particular device. And for a lot of people, that might be all you really have to do here too, is to literally just go through, restart it, and that might be all you really need to do here as well. If you end up doing that and that still doesn't end up working, the other thing you may want to try doing here is to just go through and see if there's a way, once again, to delete that game and reinstall it. Sometimes you may just have to, you know, delete a game entirely and just reinstall that game in order for it to fix it, whether it's a game or an application or whatever. Try doing that and that could very well end up fixing the problem too. So those are a couple ways to fix it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, Zolda.